previously on Let's Play Manhunt 2. Hello! That's him, that's Pikmin. Pikmin? They lost him. To be expected, he was the very best. Remember, alive if you can manage it. If not, get the head to me as soon as possible. Are the project behind this too? They're behind everything, Danny. Daniel, please untie me. I want you to remove the Pikmin Bridge. If I take it out, what do you think will happen to you? I'll be free. No, you'll be dead. Now let me speak to Daniel. Shut up! Uh. Danny's gone. Uh. Shut up or what, Leo? It only takes one phrase for you, Leo. Don't push Or me. what, huh? What seest thou else? Dark, backward, and abysmal time! Uh. When I came to, Leo was dragging me out of the lab. He said Pikmin was dead. Oh god, the I monkeys. I knew I could never find the key to my past. But Leo said there was another, one last person we could get answers oh, from. Oh yeah, I remember that I lady. searched everywhere. Days turned into weeks. I was slowly becoming a ghost. <laughs> what does that mean? 14, oh, four, yeah. 11, cerebral Had enough. No, no, you can't no quit, Danny. There's gotta be something in these tapes I can use. To help you. Yeah, right, Leo. I know something's up. Dr. White? Who? We're gonna have what do you mean, to who? You seriously don't remember Dr. White? Come on. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Someone's coming for us. Alright, so, uh... Alright, bloodhounds, let's tag him and bang him! Yeah, let's tag him and bag him. Um, so, uh, this level's kind of interesting, I guess. I'm using the, the beta files, which doesn't change too much. One -on -one time with this asshole. Okay. Make sure this guy doesn't see us. And over here is not actually a katana, but it's actually an, an axe. I'm not really sure why the beta version does that. But we will be getting a real axe, I mean a real sword real soon. Hold on a second. I'm gonna kill this guy. I don't think I've shown you guys this one yet. What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Alright, that was fun. And, uh... <laughs> Lock up your daughters, we got a killer on the loose. Um, you know, we've only got four more levels left. Well, five levels, really, if you count the, the shitty extra stage at the end of the game. Um, let's see here. Sneak up on one of these people. Sneak up on you, and I'm gonna kill you. Right, so... What do you want, applause? Oh, kill these fuckers! Even though, uh... Even though it looks like a sword that's in my hand, it's actually an axe. So, uh... There we go. No one here but us chickens. I've lost the scent. Uh-oh, he's gonna look. He's gonna look at us with his scary mask. Hope we don't have to play that minigame again. I'm seriously not good at that. Alright. You really can't see me, guy. Come on. Come on. Alright, um... Right, so I kind of repent now, boy, and you'll die quick. What? Anyway, I kind of got the day off because of uh, circumstances. I'm sure if you guys have been watching the news, you Look know what it this. is. And... A massacre. Oh God. What happened? Who cares? They were all working for the project. All right. You're not telling me the whole story, Leo. I tell you the whole story, and your brain would implode. Trust me. Oh, Leo is a fucking liar. And here's the real Hattori Hanzo sword, the Hattori Hanzo steel. Let's try it out. Actually, I'm kind of excited because the beta changes the executions a little bit for the sword, so I haven't seen him either. Let's see. Oh. Yeah. And... Oh, what? Oh, damn it. I fucked up. Ah, oh, I'm sorry about that. Let's try that again. And... Oops. 
Oh. Let him come to us. We'll kill them all. Come on, you motherfucker. Yeah. Time to push this right. to the next level, Danny. Everyone must die. <laughs> this guy looks hilarious. I don't know what it is. He just looks gross, right? Like some dirty, dirty moonshiner. Um, did I pick up the gun? Yes, I did. So, this stage starts out as a sneaking level right here, and then it quickly becomes a shooting level, but I'm gonna try to fit in some more sword executions before we get into the shooting. My god. Look at all these bodies chopped up into little bitty pieces. Um, yeah. So, um, let's recap the story so far. I mean, I know I'll, I'll probably put in a... You know, previously on Manhunt thing, but I just want to talk about it because there's not really much else to talk about. Um, well, basically, we killed Pikmin, who is was the, the head of the project, and now um, Leo is trying very hard uh, to find someone who has information about the project. But we've just been killing so many people; it, it's kind of it kind of makes you wonder. You know, who who could we possibly go to for help? Well, it's probably Dr. White, that lady at the very beginning of the game, the one who was trying to help Danny, I guess, you know. Um, and, uh, but you gotta wonder, what, uh, what does Leo think Danny needs help with anyway? I mean, he's free, pretty much everyone from the project's dead, and no one can stop him, so why would he need help? What could he possibly need to use, you know? Um, maybe to get rid of Danny's headaches, but... Alright, ooh, that's a new one. Oh, off with his head. Nice. Let's hide. Ow, hey! Ow, 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 ow! Get off me, you jerk. Alright, let's see if we can... Oh, I'm gonna run all the way back here. Let's see if we can execute some more people. This Yankee's not kidding around. Um, ugh, this could have gone smoother, right? No, oh, whatever. I really just want to show off the other executions. There's nothing here worth killing. Oh yeah, I think you're worth killing. Man, this is the life. <laughs> I guess he's enjoying himself. Let's try that again. There we go. There we go. Oh! Oh my. Let's try that again. Oh, yeah. Revenge is sweet! <laughs> so, in the original execution, uh, the, the, the non-bait execution, Danny actually takes that guy's hit off in one swing, but in level three, he doesn't quite get it right the first time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, jumping execution. Yeah. Nice. You're dead, my friend. You're very, very, very dead. <laughs> so, that's about it for the sneaking executions. Now, from here on in, it's a shoot, shoot, bang, bang stage. So, let's get started, huh? Alright. You gotta be careful in these shoots, shootouts, because you can't really get headshots. Um, you gotta shoot a lot of people at range. What? Oh, there's a guy. Ow. All right, now we're going to go up here, take cover. Right, i got to be careful with my ammo here because uh, I'm almost out. There we go. Fuck the project! Fuck them all! All right, and sounds like the crowd's really enjoying this this uh thing here. So, oh, oh shit! There's a moonshiner again, and we got a guy up here too. Is he gonna come around, or is he no? All right, whatever. We'll get to him eventually. There's a lot of interesting sets in this level. The Terry Helmet Show. Uh, I wonder if one of these people are Terry, huh? Well, it's not this guy. We know that. Is it you? Are you Terry Helmet? 
Is Terry actually a lady's name? Actually, I guess if Terry was a lady, it'd probably be spelled with an I, right? You know? For some reason, there are crowbars around, but we don't want a crowbar. We want a gun. Alright. Um, there we go. I don't have to do that. I just want to. <laughs> Let's get this off here. And this guy's packing an Uzi. Now, from this point on, everyone's going to be packing automatic weaponry. So we got to be careful. Let's see if we can get this guy with the... Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. shoot. No, no, no. Oh, man. I can't believe that happened. <laughs> wow. If I was just playing... The... Make sure he ain't fooling. Uh huh. If I was playing the game, I just would have shot him in the head, but. Well. Oh, seriously? I gotta go through this again? You gonna pay your taxes now, draft dodger? We got him stuck. Let's move on. Let's rip him a new asshole. Alright. Take it, motherfuckers! Take it! So, uh, how do you guys see a good movie recently? I haven't seen any movies in a while. Well, actually, that's not true. I, I've seen good movies, um, just not in the theater. You know, I, I know a lot of people nowadays, they don't like to spend money on the movies because, you know, most of the movies are just rehashed bullshit. The movies are very expensive, but, well, fuck you, man. There we go. So, the last movie I saw was about a week ago. Had Brad Pitt in it, although he wasn't really the star star. I mean, he was in it, but, you know. Called Killing Them Softly. And he was basically a... Whoa, there's a lot of them there. He's basically a mafia assassin. And he's charged with the job of... Hold on a second, I want to kill again. He's charged with the job of killing two guys who robbed uh, some other mafia guys or something. You know, I was watching it with my mother. She didn't really seem to like it too much. I liked it. You know, it, it wasn't like an action movie. It wasn't like a. It wasn't like a typical movie. It was. Uh, it was a little different. You know, I, I like things that are a little different. I. Uh, but I don't like things that are too different. You know, I'm very much like uh, very much like everyone else in that. I like things only slightly different and not too different. Okay, so uh, no. this guy. A lot of this level is um, very carefully picking people off because, uh, really, as you've seen before, these Uzis will destroy you if you're not careful. There we go. TV MK. We're going to the kids' studio now. Wonder what's gonna be there, huh? No one can stop us! We're motherfucking invincible! Ugh. <sighs> There we go. So, uh, yeah, nice, right? What happened here? I mean, did Leo do all this? Did Leo really hang this guy? I mean, I get you kill the guy, but what's the point in hanging him? You know, that's just... Huh, I don't know what kind of show this is. What the f... What? That son's, like, face is stitched closed. That's disgusting. What? I don't, you know, I've never actually looked at the things here. Frankie and the Freaks? Huh. Oh, God. Skull flowers. And, of course, the whole floor is like, uh... The Project logo. Huh. <laughs> Frankie and the Freaks. Jesus. Who's that laughing, huh? All right, I'm gonna run over here real quick and get them as they come out. 
What are you gonna do, Danny? What are you gonna do? There we go. You're all dead now. Whoa. Right in the nutsack. Is there anything interesting around here? No, there really isn't. No, more dead bodies. Ugh. You know, there's a torso of a lady here, but the the where's where's her where's uh where's the upper part of her body, huh? I wonder. Okay. Oh, I actually got him to come all the way over here. Huh. Normally, I have to go down the hallway to get to these guys, but they're stupid enough to come after me. That's just fine. Okay. It's the Alright. Um. Huh. You know. Are there any other games out there that kind of use that laugh track as you're killing people thing? I kind of feel like there has been before, but you know, I haven't seen it. Um, the whole concept kind of reminds me of a game called Wet. It came out a few years ago. It wasn't very good. It was kind of a kind of a mediocre third-person shooter killing simulator, but it had this whole uh, you know. Uh, pulp Fiction, Grindhouse movie thing going on. You know, back when that thing was still popular. Alright, so here we are in the Wild West. I think it's half past five noon or something like that. Um, and this level is a little tricky because... Uh, this stage, this part is very big. And... My Uzi just doesn't have the range to reach these guys, but these guys are packing assault rifles. And, uh, the assault rifles have very good range, obviously, because they're rifles. Let's see if we can get this guy. Anyway, if you thought the guys with the Uzis were dangerous, well, <laughs> the guys with the assault rifles are super dangerous. They're just... Yeah, see that? My Uzi won't reach. Okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> that guy was an arm. That's pretty funny. <laughs> I think the funniest thing about this level is the fact that there are a lot of guys running around who just aren't armed with anything. You know? Oh, wow. That's gross. Is there anything in here? Oh, a crowbar! Yeah, that's what I want. <laughs> Psych. Alright. Uh, five past high noon. I wouldn't be surprised if that's another GTA TV show you can watch. I know for GTA 4, they had some pretty funny TV shows on the TV there. My favorite was uh, Republican Space Rangers. Anyone remember that? Republican Space Rangers. I hope there are funny TV shows like that in the fifth game, right? Yeah, I'm sure there will be. Just making sure there are no survivors. Alright, let's watch some TV. I'm kinda bored. This is the story of a ranch that lies between love, duty, trust, and hate. It sits just outside Heaven's Gate. Cause every city is hell, and the kids are pain in blood. God lies, kids. Nature will kill. It's a ranch where sinners don't expect forgiveness. And a man lives alone with his demons. Soon, listen for the blood. Listen for the bell at five past high noon. Damn. That's a show I want to watch. <laughs> About some old guy that never moves around. <laughs> Okay, spinning guns and poker chips and shit. Alright. Anyway, the assault rifle is really overpowered. I mean, the Uzi, at least it has a limited range, but, um, you know, the, the assault rifle is just plain broken. So, this part coming up here is the last part of the stage, 
And if you skip the cutscene that's coming up, you can actually kind of get a jump on the enemies. But I'm not going to do that, because this is a Let's Play, and I want to show you everything I can. So let's go. It's payday, boys. We got him for sure this time. Oh, you think so, huh? You gotta be very careful this part. Okay. You're stupid. You gotta be careful with the cars too, because they will explode. Getting the shit kicked out of me. Hold on. I know it's weird, um... I'm out of range. Okay. If I just bum rush this guy... What, really? You gonna turn your back on me? Huh. Let's see. Yeah! Everyone's dead! <laughs> Alright. So the cars explode, but they don't actually do explosion damage in this particular level, which is really weird, because in the coming stages they will. I don't know. Anyway, um, I'm Nick Meister, and this is Let's Play Manhunt 2. I'll see you next time. Yada yada.